Hi, this is Ken from Cadimage, and in this movie I'm going to show you how you can install the Cadimage tools using our free trial mechanism. First thing we have to do is go to the free trial page on mycadimage.com. So this is the page you see. If you've already registered, then obviously you can sign in to mycadimage using this section here. But in this case, I'm going to go through the registration details. So I've entered my email, my name, company name, the usual sort of details. The final thing to do here at the bottom is check your terms and conditions and when you're happy with them, click the accept button and then register. The next page it takes us to, it has three sections across the top here where we can choose which version of ARCHICAD we want to trial the tools inside. So we have ARCHICAD 18 and Start Edition 2015, 17, Start 2014, 16, Start 2013. Depending on which one you pick, if we go here, you'll see the details change slightly. And that's because the installation mechanism is slightly different from version to version. So I'm going to go with ARCHICAD 18. And what it does is it actually breaks down everything I have to do to go through the installation and get it up and running on the machine itself. There's also some help files and some information across on the right hand side with some links that will also help you through the process if you're having any problems. So the only thing I have to do now is choose do I want to download the Mac or the Windows version. In this case I'm running on a Mac so all I do is click the Mac download link and you'll see that starts the process. We can then read through the rest of the details of everything I've got to do, but what I'll do is skip down to the bottom here and start the download going for the work environment because there's two parts to the process here. All I have to do now is wait for the downloads to finish and then we can carry on. What I've done here is switch to my desktop and I've copied the downloads of the CAD image installer and also the CAD image work environment from my downloads folder onto my desktop just so they're easy to see. I've also taken a screenshot of what the Windows version looks like because you'll see if we compare these, the installer on Mac is a DMG so that has to be decompressed to then run the installation. The work environment is a zip file, again that has to be decompressed to be able to run the installer in there. But if we look at the Windows versions, these are just native exe files so on Windows you literally just double click and go through the process. So first of all the installer, install the tools and then afterwards the installer gets used to apply the work environment to ARCHICAD itself. One little note with Windows users, you may see a security message pop up that depends on your security settings on your machine. It's the normal sort of thing that just warns you that you're about to run an application that came from the web, etc, etc. It's a standard Windows thing that appears. So I'll close that for now and we'll carry on with the Mac installation. So first off, I need to decompress the installer. So I literally just double click that extracts itself over here. To do the actual installs, nice and simple, we grab the installer and just drop it into applications. You can see that places it here, and then personally what I like to do is grab that and then just drop it into my dock alongside ARCHICAD that's installed here as well. So I can now close these down because I've finished with those parts. If I want to do a tidy up, we can remove this and eject the installer. We can keep the DMG as an archive if we wish, or we can download another version if we need it at a later time. But I'm going to leave both here just now because I'm going to come back to the work environment installer shortly. So the next step is I have to launch the installer itself. Now this gives me a little security warning. I'm quite happy. So we open. And this is the first screen we see. So because I've reset everything, what I have to do first of all is connect to CADIMAGE. So all I do is enter my email and my password and then click connect. So there's actually a couple of things in installed tools that show up because I've previously had software installed and removed it for the purpose of this video. But what I'm interested in is switching to the trial and the educational versions. So if we go here, this lists all the tools that are available to install on this machine right now. So what I'm going to do is select all because I want to have all the tools. And then all I do is press the download install button and we'll be presented with the end user license agreement, which we have to go through and check. I'm over happy with it. Click the accept button to continue. The installer then does its thing, connects to our servers, downloads the software, and installs it in ARCHICAD. So we we'll leave it to continue. When the installation is complete, we get a message to tell us it's finished, and also we get a list of all the tools that have been installed. At this stage, it's important to know that ARCHICAD has to run to finish the installation. So we can click the home button, but the details shown here, they're not yet complete until ARCHICAD finishes. So all I'm going to do is quit the installer now and we'll go to ARCHICAD. 
So before I install the work environment, to complete the installation, I literally just launch ARCHICAD. So when I get to the startup screen, I'm just going to click to create a new project. We could open another project, doesn't matter, as long as we actually go through the full process of ARCHICAD fully starting up, and then we can quit to install the work environment on top. At this point, you'll see the CAD image menu and objective have appeared at the top of the screen, but we don't have the CAD image tools as yet in the toolbox. So next thing to do is quit. So simply close ARCHICAD down. I'm now going to double click on the zip file to extract that. And if we pull away, you'll see it's a slightly different icon, but this is the actual installer for the work environment itself. So again, double click. Give me a little warning, we can continue with that. And then all we have to do is click next. And the automatic install proceeds. You'll see it's pretty quick. So click done to finish. And then that's us ready to launch ARCHICAD again. The only thing I'll do maybe is a bit of a tidy up. Again, we can get rid of all these bits and pieces, whatever you want to do. If you keep an archive or bend them and download fresh, it's up to yourselves. But we no longer require these files at this stage. So I'm just going to select them and bend them. I'll now reopen ARCHICAD. Again, I'll just go for a blank new file. And this time what you'll see is the CAD image tools have been integrated to the toolbox. So we have the slab edge tool, poly stairs, railings. Coming down we have cabinets, electrical, framing and extrusions which are part of objective. Doors and windows don't exist in here because those are accessed through the standard door and window tool and coverings is only available through the menu up here at the top of the screen. So that completes the installation. If you need more information on the tools, you can visit the main website, cadimage.com. And to access the objects and downloads for ARCHICAD, you can go to mycadimage.com.